Hey guys, welcome to my next uh, 7 Days to Die series. It's going to be called Endgame. And it's just going to be a standard survival series. Uh, it is in a uh, random gen map. The uh, seed for the map is the same as the name of the series. Exactly the same way it's spelt. And it's going to be Warrior Difficulty, 64 Zombie Hordes, and everything else is going to be basically vanilla settings. And it's just going to be a nice survival series, see how long I can last. If it gets a little easy, then I'll try and make it a little harder. But uh, just want to try and uh, have a good run run series through. Uh, probably try and get to the end of uh, Alpha 19. See, what, see if I can make it to Alpha 20 with this series. I don't think it'll be too long before that one comes out, but we'll see. Anyway, I'm just going to run through these quests, or these uh, challenges in the beginning here, and uh, get myself set up. Uh, as usual, it is going to be a permadeath, um, but otherwise, everything else is uh, as stated. I've never been in this world yet. I don't know where anything is. I don't see any houses yet either. So I'm probably going to have to complete these quests, find the uh, trader, and uh, see if I can't find a... Or is that a house over there? Oh, that might be a house over there. Sure. Let's uh, let's run through these quests and uh, find this trader and see what's going on. All right. Now I just got to place down a frame upgrade and throw down a fire and then uh, we're good to go here. see a chicken and try and kill that chicken as well get myself some meat so I can get started uh, with some food nice and early if I can find the chicken now looks like it might be gone all right there we go Now that I got those four skill points, we're going to go ahead and put them in. I'm going to do one into Pummel Pete, one into Sexual Tyrannosaurus, uh, one into Minor 69er, and one into Lucky Looter. And I'm gonna make my way towards this uh, trader. It's not very far away. And then we'll see what we can find to uh, to raid or find a job, maybe. Super laggy. Okay. Uh, see what we can find for a job and uh, take care of that, and uh, maybe find somewhere or maybe the job that we uh, do, we can turn that into our place of residence. Oh, we're going to start off with Sneaky Pete here. This lag is brutal. Took a hit because of it. I was getting worried I was going to actually possibly die early on because of that. I don't know what's going on here. Hold on a sec. Okay, well here's hoping the lag is done. At least for the most part, anyway. Make our way to this trader, pick up some stuff on the way, and uh, get ourselves a job. Jesus. Fucking lag. It's a nice big factory. Is 
with the shotgun messiah? Looks like it. All right, looks like it's uh, what is this Trader Bob? I think this is Trader Bob. Trader Bob. We have great prices. I don't believe you. Oh, clear zombies, nice and close. Yeah, I think we'll do that one. You the man. All right, let's let's search around Trader Bob's here and see what we got. Anything back there? No. Nice. He's got some cars I can search. Oh yeah. Two level two shovels, but I'll take them. Uh, so, workbench isn't working. broken shitty oh well looks like the lag's gonna get better though that's kind of nice hey Bubba I'll deal with you soon it's gonna get my stuff Toilet pistol. I like toilet pistol. Nice. I was just hoping there was going to be a wrench in there. We're off to a good start. See what else we got. Some boots, nice. A garbage can over here. I don't think there's anything up here. Yeah, nope. Nothing up there. Alright, let's check this mailbox. Paper. Yeah, Bubba and Thick. That's right, sit down, Thick. Some sneak damage here. There we go. Sure, I want to make the barn my home, but uh, I've had worse homes than that. Sustain some life here and make some uh, make some room in my inventory. Bang! Is she back or dead? No, nope, she's dead. Oh, but that one's back. to both of you. Good night. And then now that this quest is active, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to put a uh, box down just to store my stuff till I'm done this place. I'm not going to make that same mistake twice. And I guess I'm going to be turning this place into my home for tonight anyway, so that means I got lots of time to clear it. Is that a big mama? That looks like a big mama. 
See if I can get some sneak damage on that big mama there. Good night. Pretty sure they're gonna break out of over here. Unless I can do that. I'll take that nice extra sneak damage. Oh yeah. All right, let's clear this place before it comes nighttime. There you are. Thank you. All right, let's make this storage chest and put it down. Switch out this ax. Got the farmer there, eh? Oh, come on, man. What are you doing? Good night. All right. That's the quest done. Let's see what we got here. Ammo, hopefully some 9 mil, that'd be nice. Oh yeah, there we go. Oh nice, more 9 mil. And a better club, then I don't have to make one. A better bow, nice. Better arrows, a blunderbuss. Don't think I'm gonna be using that now that I got a 9 mil. Yeah, let's take all that. Take all that. A tin can. More ammo over here. Shut these doors and I gotta block this wall off. All right, guys, I guess we're going to call it here. It uh, turned out to be a pretty good day. We got a lot of things accomplished. We got ourselves a place all cleared out here, We've completed a job. Uh, I can trade that in tomorrow. Um, I'm going to continue working on this, uh, this barn here and turn it into a base um, and finish clearing out all the rest of the, you know, cement and uh, wood pallets and whatever else is around here. Um, but uh, with that all said, uh, I want to thank you guys for watching and all the support. It really does help out a lot. Uh, you guys can follow me on Twitter at TundraGamesYT and stick around for some more endgame. And I will catch you guys in the next one.